I'm going to give a little demo here about palleting a brush. Palleting a brush is very important. It's probably the, the most important thing in achieving good line quality and getting your paint consistency to the proper working characteristics. What I'm doing is I'm dipping my paint in the brush into my reducers and I'm working it on the palette to get it to the right brushing feel. You want the right feel on your paint. Everybody has their own preferences. I like mine to be kind of like a thick cream. And what you do is you work the brush back and forth, flipping it back and forth, and you do a little snake action. Just wriggle it through like a snake in the grass. What that does is it helps distribute the paint evenly through the bristles. Once you've done this, a couple more pats on each side, and then you tap. This means a lot because what this does is it sets your brush up for the stroke. And it doesn't hurt to, before you actually apply it to the surface, is to take a little piece of uh, the palette and just get a little test feel to make sure that it's flowing the way you want. So it's back and forth, constantly checking your consistencies. It also helps if you pre-thin some of your one-shot paint to the right consistency first. It'll inevitably dry up on the palette as you're working, so you're constantly going to be feeding it new reducers just to keep it workable. But it's back and forth, snake in the grass, back and forth, tap, test.